Got some new information about the story we first told you about last night. Shirts police say they are now investigating two travel trailer thefts from the same storage facility. Kamal County Sheriff's deputies last night found the RV that belonged to retired Army Major in our story yesterday. And just last week, Cibolo police got a call about another one. Jesse Degariata reports both victims say those travel, travel trailers, when they were recovered, were so badly damaged, they're of little use now. From here, the newly recovered travel trailer looked fine, but the closer David Johnson got, he had his doubts. After all, it was stolen weeks ago from this storage facility in Shirts. So now that the owner has seen the travel trailer, is it in better or worse condition than he thought? I expected it to be ratted out. They gutted it. They took pretty much anything of value. Joseph Rushlow knows what that's like. His travel trailer was stolen around the same time last month from the same shirt storage facility. And they took everything, even the toilet paper that was in the trailer. Rushlow's was found after a Cibolo landowner reported a suspicious vehicle was left on his property. It was stashed up in some, under some trees and it was wedged in there pretty good. The towing company said they almost didn't get it out of there. Cibolo has now turned the case over to Shirts Police to look into any possible links. But why travel trailers? If people can try and sell it as legitimate when it's not, it's quick and easy money. But not before making themselves at home. So they must have slept in here because this air mattress is not mine either. Still, Johnson says he was amazed how it was spotted in the community of Garden Ridge soon after we aired his story. They could have saw the news and saw that we were looking for it and got scared and decided to dump it. That's definitely a possibility. If they didn't, Johnson reiterated what he told me then. You heard me say it yesterday, right is right, wrong is wrong. And these guys did very wrong. In New Braunfels, Jesse Degollado, KSAT 12 News.